All right, so the chat GPT plugins have arrived, and to be honest, I think this could be the most significant improvement that chat GPT has seen yet. This introduction opens up a whole world of new possibilities. You can expect that a ton of these plugins will be developed and launched in the future, and for sure, it's going to create quite the competitive landscape in the generative AI industry, which makes it even more exciting. Also, OpenAI just rolled out the ChatGPT browsing plugin to all ChatGPT Plus members. As we know, the main issue with ChatGPT was that it was limited by its training data, which stops in 2021. So it was kind of stuck when it came to answering questions about anything that happened after that. But now, with this new feature, ChatGPT has been given access to the internet, which really means that there are no more data restrictions and it's got the whole web available. Okay, to use this plugin, first, you need to be a ChatGPT Plus member. Once you're a member, adding the browsing plugin is easy. You just click the three dots in the bottom right, click on Settings, click on Beta Features, and toggle Web Browsing so it is on. Then, in the chat, click the drop-down onto GPT-4 and select Browsing, and you're in. Now, if you remember in March, OpenAI officially announced 11 third-party plugins, including branded offerings from Instacart, Kayak, and Zapier. But now, there are more than 70 third-party plugins available, including ones for chess play, recipe finding, live soccer, and nutrition. And for developers who want to create a ChatGPT plugin, there's a waitlist for access. Now, let's get started with the first one. It's called SpeechKey. It's this really cool text converter that turns text to speech, and you could actually download the audio, and it even comes with an audio player page that you could embed on different websites and social apps. Okay, up next, we've got Copart. Now, who doesn't love a good deal? This nifty plugin searches the internet for the best deals and finds you coupons. Then there's Wolfram. This one is a rock star. It gives you access to real-time data, can answer complex math problems, and even fetches the weather for you. Real multitasker. And then there's EDX. This plugin is like your personal academic advisor, connecting you to courses and content from leading universities. Let's say you want to learn physics from a top university. This plugin will now make that possible for you. Next up is the One Word Domain plugin. It's a lifesaver for anyone who's ever struggled to find a domain name. It does the searching and price comparing across different registries for you. And if you've ever had to create and buy a domain before, then you would appreciate this one. And there are plenty more. We also have Tasty, WebPilot, VoxScript, Zapier, Kayak, Expedia, and Diagram plugins. Each of these brings something unique and mind-blowing to the table. Whether it's finding recipes, writing articles, generating YouTube transcripts, connecting different apps, finding the best travel deals, or creating diagrams. Honestly, there are so many possibilities that I am getting excited just by talking about it. And then there is maybe the most powerful plugin so far, Zapier. This plugin links apps together, transforming ChatGPT into pretty much whatever you want. Zapier was already a heavy hitter before it partnered up with ChatGPT, but this integration has made it an even bigger sensation. Essentially, Zapier is a handy little tool that builds bridges between various apps, letting them share information and collaborate more effectively. When it's hooked up with ChatGPT, it offers enhanced functionality and automation capabilities. For example, you could configure an automated workflow or a ZAP to relay data from a Google Sheets document straight to your email at the end of each day. You could whip up zaps for any task your heart desires, automating a broad range of jobs without having to be a tech whiz or coding guru. This integration of Zapier and ChatGPT can really smooth out your workflow, sync data between your go-to apps, and automate a variety of tasks. It's an incredibly flexible tool that opens up a whole world of customization and efficiency possibilities. So, as you can see, ChatGPT is being designed to be kind of like your own personal helper. It's there to teach you stuff, give you advice, guide you when you're traveling, and a whole lot more. It's looking like this could become an ultimate tool that just about everyone might need to use pretty soon, unless you want to miss out and get left behind. Now let's circle back to the web browsing plugin, because I just want to spend a few moments talking about the things you can do with this tool. So here are just a few examples. Well... Let's start with something pretty straightforward, writing. Now that ChatGPT has internet access, 
It simplifies the whole process of gathering information for you. This means you can literally ask it to write on any subject, even if it's about events that occurred just yesterday. Plus, it has this neat feature where it can read from any links you drop into the chat. This is really handy because you can just paste a bunch of links that are related to the topic you're interested in and ask it to craft a write-up based on those articles or research papers and so on. Next, it can really simplify your travel planning. Imagine this. You're in a new city and you're not really sure what to do. Instead of stressing out, you can simply ask ChatGPT to help you out. It has the ability to look up all the events and activities that are happening in the city during your visit. What's more, it can even tailor these suggestions based on your personal preferences. Then, you can use it to brainstorm content ideas. Like, you might ask it to check out your social media pages or maybe even your competitors. It could also keep an eye on the latest news and events, which could spark some really good content ideas. And here's the best part. You could even ask it to rank these ideas on a scale from 1 to 10, based on how likely they are to go viral. That would really simplify things, don't you think? You know, it's actually pretty helpful to use ChatGPT for checking out what your competitors are up to, because it's super important to know what they're doing in order to come up with a solid business plan. ChatGPT can give you a hand with looking over your competitors' websites, figuring out their tactics, and offering some ideas that could really spark your own content and business strategies. Then you can use it for education and research, like if you're a student working on an essay, right? Or even if you're a professional just wanting to stay in the loop with the latest trends in your industry. It can browse the internet and gather all the newest studies, statistics, and findings on whatever topic you're into. And that saves you time and guarantees you've got the most up-to-date info. So, what does this mean for the tech world? Well, it's a huge deal. ChatGPT plugins could change everything in the generative AI field. They could make ChatGPT more than just a tool, but a platform that can do all. They could help make ChatGPT more accurate, collect better data, and maybe even take over some websites. But they could also create some problems for data that needs to be protected. It's a big change for what ChatGPT can do especially since Google just announced some major BARD improvements last week at their I.O. event. However, OpenAI is not alone in this race. The open source community is closing in, with thousands of developers working on autonomous AI agents with future web surfing possibilities. Demos like AutoGPT and AgentGPT were the talk of Twitter last month, and startup HyperWrite announced its own demo of an AI agent that can surf the web, used through a Chrome extension. So it's clear that as usual, OpenAI is moving fast to stay ahead. However, we can't say for sure if they'll be able to maintain their lead. And that's a wrap, guys. The future is here and it's powered by AI. With plugins, ChatGPT becomes more than just an AI. It becomes a versatile, powerful tool that can help you in countless ways. From education and research to travel planning and content creation, the possibilities are endless. But what we're witnessing here is just the start, you know? And it looks like things have gotten a whole lot more intriguing and intense in the world of AI. So stay tuned, guys. We'll keep you updated on all the important happenings in the field of AI and bring you fresh and interesting content. So be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up because it really means a lot to us. If you'd like to support our work and help us continue delivering high-quality videos on this channel, you can do so by clicking the Join button or the link in the description. By becoming a member of the channel, you'll not only show your support, but also become part of our growing community. Plus, you'll gain access to some awesome perks that can be found in the member section. We're confident that together, we can keep the AI revolution going strong.